Hey guys, Dezzles here, and welcome to this week's Wi-Fi Pokemon Battle thingy. Yes, I used the word thingy. So this battle's against a good friend of mine, Silver, and this was the last time I went and visited him because he lives in another city. We decided that we'd have some magic battles and we'd have some Pokemon battles and do that sort of thing. Now, this battle, uh, despite looking like it may be um, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, it's running by the XY rules because that's what Silver was running, which is a shame because I'd brought up a new Pokemon that I was really hoping to get to use and I didn't get to because it requires Mega to be used how it's set up, so I didn't get to use it. So let's have a look at the team. There's a number of Pokemon in his team that will take a fair bit of damage from Ice type moves, which is always nice because Flying and Dragon Pokemon are, are a lot of trouble pretty much all the time. That Cloyster there, I'm pretty sure, is one that I trained for um, Silver. And if it's the one that I think it is, it is a massive threat. It has Skill Link, and it's got um, moves that take advantage of it. I can't think of it. Is it Rock Blast? And Icicle Spear, which have base, like when you've got Skill Link, are base 125 and can completely circumvent things like so Focus Sash because they're multi-hits, but they'll always hit five times, and that's a pain in the ass. Trust me. So that's one of the big threats. If I come across it, I need to take it down as quickly as I can. So here we go. Let's see how the battle goes down for us. So there's the Cloyster. Straight up. Shit. Thankfully, I've got Kyriat, Drought. Now, Cloyster is part ice, part water, part, uh, part water of memory. So the flamethrower, while being neutral damage, will still be more than enough to take it out. So he follows up with the Talon Flame, which is always a right pain in my ass. I managed to get off the flamethrower, I outspeed it somehow. Uh, the Talon Flame uses Sword Stance, so it's becoming more and more of a threat right now, which has me very concerned. And it becomes obvious it has the leftovers. And that, that's how it's fun. So the Talon Flame goes ahead, uses a Brave Bird, and that is going to do enough damage to just absolutely destroy Kiri. To go down, but on the upside, the Talon Flame is going to take half of it, another half of its current health, full health, sorry, uh, down, and then take a little bit back to the leftovers. So, uh, it's not a good situation for me. So I'm going to follow up with 10 soon as I like to do. Anytime someone starts um, buffing up their, their Pokemon and it causes me difficulty, I'll just, I'll just steal it. It's mine now. And I respond with the same Brave Bird that it used on me. And goodbye Talonflame. And I realized that I possibly could have gotten away with using some other moves, but the recoil didn't do a huge amount of damage against me, which is nice. And he just brings out the Garchomp. Now Garchomp will um would have been neutral damage to the Brave Bird, but I didn't want to push it too far. I figured he'd probably go with the Dragon Claw, which he chose to, which meant that I got a free switch in on Rade. And free switch ins are always nice. Thankfully, on the upside also, the sun's gone, so my um water moves are also back on full damage, uh full power. I used to play rough, it takes me um it takes him out. But also, I was on very low health after that critical earthquake, so I lose Rade, and Silver loses Garchomp in the one hit. This could have gone better. So he sends out Lucario, I sent out Senior Derp. Senior Derp's super bulky, so he's always, he always tends to be pretty safe to send in and ignore that Facebook noise. So Mega Lucario comes out, that's acceptable, I can deal with Mega Lucario, I'm not sure how well Senior Derp can. But off memory, he can take a decent amount of that Shadow Ball without being um, being harmed too badly. Unfortunately, it does drop my Special Defense, which means that even if I could fully heal up, I probably can't take another one. So I take the opportunity, get out of Thunder Wave. Hopefully, this will do some do okay by me. I'm hoping for the Paralysis uh, to take advantage of the Paralysis a little bit. Use a Slack off to heal, forgetting that I've had the um, Special Defense drop. Doesn't take me quite up to full, but. I get lucky and he's paralyzed, so there's that. That's a very nice thing to come into. Now, what did I do here? I'm trying to remember. Did I attack? I used Skull. Yeah, could have done a lot worse. But the Skull, thankfully, does about half damage. Here comes the Shadow Ball. This should probably kill me. Yeah, there we go. Because the um, special defense, in all fairness, I wasn't paying too much attention because I'd been drinking. Naturally, I bring out my Mega Charizard because get the sun back out because I like having the sun and both my water Pokemon 
are down now. That hurts. I, I think I have an infected finger from cutting myself the other day. Um, use the flamethrower, which will nicely, nicely kill off the Lucario. That's always good to see. How many are we down to now? I can't remember. Brings out the Halucha. Now, Halucha's always a pain. I hate them. So naturally, I just hit it with the flamethrower, hoping for the best, and the Halucha goes down. And I think Silver's last Pokemon is it? Is his last one? Probably the last one, or close to. And I just. Solar Beam? I Solar Beam for the funsies. Probably a bad choice. It's a really bad choice, I don't know why I'd do that. Um, the Thunderbolt doesn't manage to take me down. We were real with the God of War's Life Orb here. Doesn't make much difference. I actually use my Flamethrower, but it's a smart thing to do. Oh god, I'm he painted an ash move, didn't I? And that's the battle that I had against Silver. So I think I, in a lot of ways I just got lucky that I managed to take down that cloister as quick as I did. Because if I didn't, it would have caused me a world of trouble. You know, unless I sent out my ditto against it. And that's the battle. Alright, I will see you guys next week with another Pokemon battle. See you later. Bye.